welcome back to the brew house today we have gary with the morocco shrine center and he's going to tell us a little bit about how he got involved and what they do for the city of jacksonville so um i know that you've been a shriner for 35 years so yes. What made you, what sparked your interest? In my younger days, I joined the shrine because all my neighbors were shriners. My parents were, my father was a shriner, and I remember going to the parades, the activities, the fun things like the circus. So it was kind of a cool thing to do. So I got involved. I found out about the Shriners Hospital for Children, um, which provide free medical care for kids. Um, so it really got me involved into it. Well, that's great. Yeah. That's um, So you kind of were influenced by the people that were around you. Correct, yes. My neighbors were, parents were, so it really sucked me in. Yes. Yeah. Um, so along with that, so what exactly, um, since you've been there for such a long time, what have you learned from where it was when you started and how it has evolved now? What have you seen like as the biggest change? Probably the demographics. Um, over the years, we kind of became older, but it seems now that younger people are starting to come back into the fraternity of the shrine. Uh, but I see a sense of people wanting to help people, which the hospitals provide, and it really makes me feel good to see younger people. My children, who are now in their 30s, they actually want to be involved, so <laughs> it makes me feel happy. That's great. So carrying on the tradition with Correct. that. Yes. Um, so I know that you do the cir that the Morocco Shrine Center has a circus every year. Mm -hmm. um, I've actually been, and I thought it was amazing. So tell us a little bit about um, what you do with the circus. Uh, the circus is really a fundraiser and a public events awareness for the shrine. Uh, we, it starts next Thursday night and runs through the weekend, a couple of shows Saturday, a couple of shows Sunday. Uh, it's, an, it's a family event. We have a tent circus, which is an old-fashioned circus, but it is air-conditioned. A mm -hmm. uh, petting zoo, uh, just an old-fashioned family fun day. That's the way we look at our circus, to have it. And um, I know that being family and friendly and family fun, is that something that you all like to carry, like to carry through what you guys do yes. at all the events? We are, all of our events are family friendly. Um, and we have actually what we call a legacy program in the Shrine where we have people that can track their family into four, four generations of people being in the Shrine. Wow. So it's, an, you know, it's a family man's organization, but a, certainly a family event. Now, you also do a lot of things in the community. I know that um, you also participate in the Beaches Parade. I was there um, about a year ago, so I remember mm -hmm. that you guys were driving yeah. the little... Oh, we have cars, cars clowns, yes. <laughs> um, go-karts, buggies, people that walk, musicians, but we're in just about parades all over North Florida. So, we, the Beaches is probably the biggest parade, mm -hmm. only because that's the biggest parade in Jacksonville. Yes, it is. Um, so do you drive the little car? I have. You have? <laughs> I have driven a car before. Um, I've actually um, done just about everything in there. I've driven a car. I've rode in a trailer one time. I've walked. I actually tried to play a musical <laughs> instrument one time in a parade. So uh, it's, again, just a fun event. The Beaches is probably the best parade I think, in North Florida mm -hmm. that we go to. So aside from doing things outside of the Morocco Shrine Center, um, you also have a lot of events that you host there. So tell us a little bit about that. Uh, yes, we have, um, we host everything from gun shows to weddings to um, culture club, actually. Boy George is coming in a couple of months out there. So we have huge concerts. Uh, we have our main auditorium can hold like 3,000 people. Um, and we are just, we're open, we have, we're open just about anything really. So um, we, we run a wide variety of events out there. So great venue yeah. space. Venue space, yes, it's huge inside. We're probably one of the largest non-government owned convention areas that you can rent. Well, I know that. Um, so with the space, um, can people select how big they want it, or is there like a certain type of? No, uh, we have the main, what we call the main auditorium is like 30,000 square feet. Then we have a dining room that's 10,000, another auditorium that's at 4,000. Um, so it, we can break it down, we can move walls, we can put up tables, we can put up, take down tables, <laughs> it's wide open. It's very so, custom yeah, customizable. Cust yes, customizable, and we are very uh, user friendly as, as they tell us. Well, thank you um, for coming. Is there anything else that you would um, like to share while we're wrapping this up? Come see us at the circus. Come see I'll us at the circus. And but when is the, what's the dates, what are the dates again? 
Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Okay, and then how can people get tickets? Call us at 642-5200. Well, Gary, thank Easy. you so much for Thanks. coming. Um, I had a great time learning about the circus, your family tradition, and the venue space that the Morocco Shrine Center offers. Thank you offers. again. We'll see you there. Thanks.